What's up, y'all? I'm back again for another video. So just stay tuned, and I'll be back. So what's up y'all? I'm back again for another video. So this is another one. It's another one. It's this highly requested. So it's another little QA video. I found some little questions y'all wanted me to answer. So I'm saying we're gonna get started. Make sure you leave a like, comment, share, repost, subscribe, all that good stuff. So you know what I'm saying? Hope y'all having a good day, you know. It's coming up. Fourth of July weekend. I'll probably do mine tomorrow. I ain't gonna celebrate 4th of July, but we celebrate tomorrow. So, I'm gonna turn out though. So, let's get right to this video. First, this is the first question they asked me. Okay. When did you screw up everything, but no one ever found out it was you? So, it was this one time at work. And I, I took, I, I don't know why I brought this, but it was fine. It was some cabbage with shrimp in it, so... I'm think I'm thinking in my head that it's somebody else. So I put it in the microwave. You know, you can't smell it, smell it. But you know, if you bring shrimp or cabbage or something, it's gonna be real fishy, like so. Then, <coughs> then the whole building. You had to get out the whole building. Like it was just crazy. Whole building was stanky. But it was this other lady. Turned out she had some stanky fish, and she let it sit in the refrigerator too long, and she had heated it up. And it was how it wasn't me though. Uh, would you name your boat if you had one? What would you name your boat? Boat? I gotta escape. Hey, the pop in the rape. No. I don't know. What will finally break the internet? <coughs> well, I guess if I'm on here with Rihanna, Brianna, all them fine women. Rihanna, Brianna's. All them fine women. If I get on here with these videos, it's gonna break the internet. I guarantee it. What celebrity would you rate as a perfect ten? I I gotta get at the Beyonce. She's just fine. She's just fine. What fictional uh, fictional character would be the most boring to meet in real life? Probably some of the Harry Potter movie, something like that. Harry Potter, I'm gonna go with that. What is the best and worst purchase you ever made? Let's just say I bought some stuff that I should have took it back. Or probably some shoes one time, and I know I shouldn't have bought them. So I have some shoes or some kind of electronic stuff that tow up later. Um, if you had to change your name, what would your new name be, and why would you change your name? Obviously, I'm not changing my name, I like my name. So we, we we just gonna skip that one. What are some things that sound like compliments but are early insults? I really like your hair. The way the way your forehead is shaped, it curves, it coutures all your features. <laughs> coutures. Like it makes it look good. <laughs> okay. Okay. What's a body part that you wouldn't mind losing? I don't know. I like to keep all mine, you know what I'm saying? I keep it all intact. What's your biggest screw up in the kitchen? Probably nothing. Probably messed up something in the microwave or something, you know what I'm saying? Everybody ain't nothing to that. You know? What's the worst commercial you've seen recently and why it's so bad? Yet, why y'all keep seeing all these commercials for herpes and all this stuff? Just stop. J just stop. I don't want to hear about the cream. May cause all, uh, upset stomach diarrhea. Do, 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 do. Did it be naming all this stuff? Why are you taking it? For prep? What are you prepping for? Just don't do it. What's the closest thing to real magic? I don't know. Snapping your fingers? What is the craziest? What's the craziest thing one of your teachers has done? Oh, this teacher, that art teacher, I forgot what her name was, but one time somebody touched her booty, she started cussing at like, Y'all don't be touching my booty. We like in fifth, sixth grade. Y'all ain't gonna be touching my booty. That was fun. 
I don't know who the hell touched my booty. I better not do it again. That was funny. Who is the messiest person, you know? If I tell y'all that, if I tell y'all that, we just gonna, we just gonna say, I got more than one. It's more than one person, so. Yeah, what is something you always want to try but haven't, have been too scared to? Probably just get on a plane. Just, you know what I'm saying, skydiving, jump out the plane. What quote or saying do people spout? What spout? The hell? Spout? What kind of question is that? Spout. But it's complete BS. So So you you dating somebody? Yep, pretty much. And we know you got a whole boyfriend or girlfriend. And she still be trying to not. What's something your brain tries to make you do and you have to will yourself not to do it. Um, get on phone calls that you don't want to do. Stuff that you just don't want to do. What's the dumbest way you've ever been injured? One time I was going for a rebound, twist my ankle. Like some candy ankle just went And I was just, oh my God, it was crazy. Uh, let's see. If you could know the absolute and total truth to one question, what would you ask? Why in the hell every time you get a you, you get somebody new, you supposed to fall back. I don't I don't understand. Why do you fall back every time? But then you blame it on the other person. For that. It's just it's crazy. What's the most interesting thing you read or seen this week? Uh probably nothing, but I know why I live here in Tennessee. Going back to phase two, modified, so Going backwards to get to get back right. Going backwards to get back right. Okay. What's the what what really? I can't even talk, y'all. What ridiculous thing has someone tricked you into doing or believing? Nothing. I ain't wrong. You don't catch me slipping. If you were given a one-minute ad slot during the Super Bowl that you couldn't sell, what would you fill it with? I'll probably do a commercial or something. Like, back at it again with another one. Or just like one of them cool highlight reel, reels. Yeah, I'll put that right there. One minute. What's the most useless talent you have? Uh, it's useless. I can do that. And you see that? Wait a minute. Hold on. Move my ears. That's about it. Useless. I don't know what's it for. What would be on the what would be on the gag reel of your life? Everything I'm jumping out of planes, smacking people, all type of stuff. Shooting guns, all that. Just bang, you know, just real boom action. Where is the worst smelling worst smelling place you ever been? Uh pretty much I was at work one time. Yeah. And people just come in and they just be smelling bad. Foreign people, they smell like dude, it's just this bad. It's like sourdough, you know, like sourdough milk. It's just sour. Okay, which three words best describe words describe you best? Honest, real, and unpredictable. Uh, what's your best feature? It's my smile. It's my smile. Uh, which? Wait, wait a minute. Which common saying or phrase describes you? You know what I'm saying. That's why I say that a lot. You know what I'm saying. Uh, what's the best thing that's happened to you this week? Uh, just got paid. Uh, Friday night. Feeling right. Okay. Who was your role model when you were a child? I mean, I, I was my own role model. I just looked up the people I saw on TV pretty much. Who was your favorite teacher and why? I mean, I had a lot of favorite teachers, but one of my favorite teachers was Miss Gilbert. She was dope. She used to talk about how she used to eat mayonnaise sandwiches, just bread and mayonnaise. She was like, we so poor, eat mayonnaise sandwiches. What was your favorite subject at school? It probably had to be like uh, some kind of English because I'm pretty good at writing. What did you want to be when you grew up? Basketball player? 
NBA. Shot like Curry. Uh, what's your favorite cheesy pickup line? Have you ever used it for it? Girl, I, I know you see me standing here. So, let's put two and two together. Because you know your heart belongs to me. So, just write your number down. Just write your number down. And I tell God, he sent me an angel. Yeah, that, there you go. Um, What would be your perfect job? Doing absolutely nothing. Being a boss. Making money in my sleep. Uh, What is your greatest achievement? I don't know yet. I'm still going. Have you ever won a trophy or medal? Yeah, plenty of those. Perfect attendance. Sports, all that. Yeah. What is the longest word you know? Um, let's see. Circum mycosis viola. I just made it up. It's not a word. Uh, what is? Who is the most inspirational person to you? It's probably me. And then I like looking at like different videos. I like those different pastors. You know, like Sarah Jakes, T D Jakes. Well, I just get like inspiration from those uh, Steve Harvey videos he posts on YouTube. So yeah, that's it. And where am I? At? What is the best praise or advice you receive? Keep going, don't quit. Keep going, don't stop. Don't let nobody stop you from chasing your dream. Just keep going. That's it, right there. Keep going. Uh, let's see. Uh, which would you prefer? Three wishes over five years or one wish right now? Three three wishes over five years because at least I know each each other five years I'll get what I want. So the first year you just do like I want a billion dollars and then boom, billion dollars. Then the next five I want 60 billion. Then boom, you got it. Then the next five I want a trillion dollars. Boom, you got it. Or you just do it you know, in that order. Whichever way works for you. Uh, okay, what was the worst present you received? One time my ex, she uh she forgot my birthday. And she and then when her friend birthday came around a few months later, she bought them a whole cake and all that stuff and said to me you know I'm a broke college student. I'm like, but you just bought your whole friend cake, balloons, all that, card, all that. But you couldn't buy me nothing for my birthday. And you used the excuse. I was like, see? Childish. Uh, yo, what's your, what was your favorite childhood toy? Had a lot of them. Mostly like Game Boys. And I had the Game Boy, Game Boy Color, Game Boy SP. The PlayStation, the original PlayStation had Dreamcast and all that. I didn't get Xbox, I was older. What's your favorite birthday or Christmas present? Oh, when I got a first, when I first got that PlayStation 2, and then I got a, uh, that time first I got Super Nintendo. It was dope. It was dope. What's your hidden talent? I can sing. I like T-Pain. Da -da -do, do -do. I ain't gonna sing it away, but it's a video up on my page. Y'all can find it. So, yeah. But what irritates you the most? People ask me stupid ass questions. That irritates me real bad. Stop asking me stupid shit. If you know the answer to it, just know it. Don't keep dragging it on and on and on and on and on. Because I'm not trying to hear it. But yeah. Y'all make sure y'all share this video. Y'all like, comment, and subscribe. And y'all liking these videos. So that's what I'm giving to y'all. This content. Uncut and raw. What flavor of ice cream would you be? I don't know. I'd be a mix between what? Strawberry. And that kind with the cake in it. Strawberry. Like that birthday cake. Be a mixture between that. And then you got a little red drizzle. With the, with the peanut butter. You know that stuff in there. You, you know what I'm saying. What's your favorite food? Pizza. Pizza. Favorite drink? Uh, I like, uh, I don't know. I drink a lot of different stuff. 
But I be, I used, nah. I had Fago before. It's cool though. Those are cool. Fago. I used to mess with the Hawaiian Punch in the can, or you get the in the cart the Jungle Juice, Jungle Juice thumping. What type of car would you be? I'm more like a upper class type of thing. So you know, like a Lambo or Camaro with the V8 engine and all this stuff. But yeah, it's something simple. But yeah. I done talked y'all head off enough, so I'm finna close this video out. You know what I'm saying? Y'all make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. We on the road to 2K. Soon will be 3K like Andre. So I ain't got nothing else for y'all today. So y'all just, y'all stay tuned. Y'all leave a like on this video. Y'all comment what y'all want to see. Tell me what y'all want to see. Instagram, DM me. I'm on the road to 10K on Instagram, so y'all follow me on Instagram, DJ Dre, taking over 89, so y'all do that, and I don't know what else I'm going to say to y'all, because I know this camera about to die soon, this, this lens kind of heavy, so my hand kind of drooping down, and then it keep falling, so I don't know what else to say, so yeah, you know what I'm saying, I love y'all guys, see y'all in the next video, peace.